I came the black way. I'm black. And as I told you, all of my school days, we had the poorest equipment, poorest buildings. We walked regardless to the weather. Where the others had a bus with two children on it and a driver with 18 and 20 of us walking. But never become discouraged. We went to school at Hopewell Elementary School from the first grade through eighth grade with one teacher teaching all subjects, 80 students in attendance, grades from preschool to eighth grade for one teacher. When I was in the third grade, the school had one door two windows facing each other, and one window in the back. No ceiling whatsoever. We could look up and see the metal roof and the cross pieces. We had to take turns sitting near the heater to keep our hands and feet warm move every few minutes. When I was in the third grade, the trustees applied for the Rosenwald Fund so that the children in the South could have a better opportunity in getting an education. Snow, hail, Rain, whatever it was, my parent always said, go to school because I didn't have the opportunity. My mother and father went to school when the state finished three months, December, January, and February for my parent. For me, six months was all I ever had in elementary school. From the first through the third, we went in a dilapidated school. After third grade, we got the Rosenwald School, which was the best that we ever had. For the first time in my life, we were comfortable in school. Had desks to sit in. Prior to that, we had pews out of the church to sit in. But after we got to Rosenwald Farm and the beautiful building, our parents bought desks for us. 20 little ones, 20 larger ones, and 20 big desks. So we had comfortable desks, a warm classroom, and we made the best of it. Rose above it all. Rose above it all. When I finished the eighth grade at that Rosewall School, my had the highest average of anybody in that school. But the foundation was laid there for me. In the church next to that school is where I got my early religious training. Went to Sunday school was a member of the choir, whatever it was. I grew up in that church next to the school. So all that I am, I ever hope to be, I owe it all to Hopewell Church and School. All that my parents didn't train me with, I learned it in Hopewell School. 